Namo Guruja Vagisharya. I make humble obeisance to you, great Tsongkhapa, personification of Manjushri in human form, with all the marks and signs of perfection. Your magnificent attainments were nurtured in the matrix of motherly method and wisdom combined, of which the vibrant syllable D is an embodiment. Sipping the nectars of the profound teachings, directly from Manjushri's masterly eloquence, you realize the heart of wisdom. Inspired by your example, I will now set out a description of the steps for actualization of Manjushri, the Bodhisattva of Wisdom, in accordance with your realization. In my heart, I turn to the three jewels of refuge. May I free suffering beings and place them in bliss. May the compassionate spirit of love grow within me, that I might complete the enlightening path. In my heart I turn to the three jewels of refuge. May I free suffering beings and place them in bliss. May the compassionate spirit of love grow within me, that I might complete the enlightening path. In my heart I turn to the three jewels of refuge. May I free suffering beings and place them in bliss. May the compassionate spirit of love grow within me, that I might complete the enlightening path. May all sentient beings have happiness and its causes. May all sentient beings be free of suffering and its causes. May all sentient beings not be separated from sorrowless bliss. May all sentient beings abide in equanimity, free of bias, attachment, and anger. I myself, Manjushri, this practice, its causes and results, are all empty of inherent existence because of dependently arising. The subjects, things, are not inherently produced because of not being produced from themselves, from naturally existent others, from both or causelessly. All people, phenomena, activities, etc. are all merely imputed by the mind on the valid basis. Are all dependent upon parts, upon context. In the case of impermanent phenomena, are also dependent upon causes and conditions. Om Sawa Shuddha Sawa Dhamma Sawa Shuddha Ham. Rest in awareness of emptiness, free from mental constructions and fabrications. Have single pointed meditation on your current understanding of the lack of inherent existence. Within the sphere of emptiness, a lotus and moon seed appear in front of me. Upon it sits an orange syllable D. It emits infinite light rays going in all directions. On each light ray are beautiful objects that are offered to all the Buddhas and Bodhisattvas throughout space. Again, light rays emanate, touching each sentient being and eliminating his or her suffering and its causes. All sentient beings are blissful and become Manjushri.
All of these Manjushris absorb back into the syllable D. The D transforms into Manjushri, orange in color, with one face and two arms. His right hand brandishes a sword of wisdom in the space above him. At his heart, between the thumb and ring finger of his left hand, he holds the stem of an Utpala lotus. Upon its petals in full bloom by his left ear rests a volume of the Perfection of Wisdom Sutra. He sits in the Vajra posture and is adorned with precious ornaments on his head, ears, throat, and shoulders, as well as bracelets and anklets. He is draped in a flowing mantle and skirt of exquisite silks. His hair is tied up in five knots, which coil counterclockwise. Bearing an entrancing and serene smile, he sits amidst a mass of light radiating from his body. The syllable Om marks the crown of his head, Ah, his throat, Whom, his heart. The Whom at Manjushri's heart emits rays of light that invite the wisdom beings from the inconceivable mansion of their own pure lands. They resemble Manjushri described above, are surrounded by hosts of Buddhas and Bodhisattvas. We invoke and absorb them by reciting Zahum The Buddha that you have visualized and the actual Buddha becomes non-dual. We present offerings. Om Arya Vagishara Zapariwara Ayam Prati Saum Soha Om Arya Vagishara Zapariwara Ayam Prati Saum Soha Om Arya Vagishara Sapariwar Yupe Prati Saum Soha Om Arya Vagishara Sapariwar Dupe Prati Saum Soha Om Arya Vagishara Sapariwar Aloke Prati Saum Soha Om Arya Vagishara Sapariwar Gande Prati Saum Soha Om Arya Vagishara Sapariwar Nyuade Prati Saum Soha Om Arya Vagishara Sapariwar Shabta Prati Saum Soha I make obeisance to your youthful form, O Manjushri, like that of a dynamic and graceful sixteen-year-old. You repose upon the full moon as your cushion, at the center of an expansive milk-white lotus. I make obeisance to your speech, O mighty wish-fulfiller of wishes. So mellifluent to the minds of countless sentient beings, a lucent ephony to accord with each listener's capacity its multiplicity embellishing the hearing of all fortunate ones. O Manjushri, I make obeisance to your mind, wherein is illuminated the entire tapestry of the myriad objects of knowledge. It is tranquil ocean of unfathomable profundity, of immeasurable breadth, boundless like space itself. Meditate on the clear appearance of Manjushri. Stabilize your visualization. Hold your focus single-pointedly upon it in your mind's eye using your memory.
At Manjushri's heart, upon a moon disk, is an orange syllable D. Encircling it, at the disk's periphery, stands a rosary-like mantra, Om A Rapa Tsana D. All the syllables radiate light, which gather wisdoms of explaining, debating, and writing, and the wisdoms of hearing, thinking, and meditating, possessed by the Buddhas, Bodhisattvas, solitary realizers, hearers, and the wise and learned master of all the Buddhist and non-Buddhist traditions. Contemplate the fusion of such wisdoms with your mind stream while reciting the mantra. Om Arapatsanadi 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 Om Marapatsanadi 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 Omarapatsana D. Manjushri in the space in front comes to the crown of your head, or if it feels comfortable, to your heart center. We make a request. Please grant great extensive wisdom, which has no resistance to understanding the meaning of the Buddha's extensive scriptures. From the D and mantra syllables, Orange light rays radiate in all directions. Much powerful light, like billions of suns, radiates from the D and mantra syllables at Manjushri's heart, going throughout all the pores of your body, touching all universal sentient beings, who are immediately released from their ignorance and become Manjushri. The light rays then invoke all their wisdom and realizations in the form of countless youthful Manjushris. Some are as large as mountains, some are as small as sesame seeds, and they pervade all of space. All the billions of Manjushris absorb into you through the pores of your body, uniting with you like snow falling into the ocean. Your entire body and nervous system becomes the nature of clean, clear wisdom light that destroys all physical diseases and hindrances to developing all the types of wisdom. Feel that you've generated great, extensive wisdom through concentrating on Manjushri's body.
then request, please inspire me to generate clear wisdom, which can understand the subtle and difficult points of the Dharma without confusion. Much powerful light, like billions of suns, radiates from the D and mantra syllables at Manjushri's heart, going out through all the pores of your body and touching all universal sentient beings, who are immediately released from their ignorance and become Manjushri. The light rays then invoke all their clear wisdom and realizations in the form of countless Omarapatsana Di. All the billions of Manjushri mantras absorb into you through the pores of your body, uniting with you like snow falling into the ocean. Your entire body and nervous system becomes the nature of clean, clear wisdom light, destroys all physical diseases, and hindrances to developing all the types of wisdom, in particular clear wisdom. Feel you have generated clear wisdom through concentrating on Manjushri's mantra. And we request Please inspire me to generate quick wisdom, which quickly cuts off all ignorance, wrong conceptions, and doubt. Once again, powerful light, like billions of suns, radiates from the D and mantra syllable at Manjushri's heart, going out through all the pores of your body, touching all the universal sentient beings, who are immediately released from their ignorance and become Manjushri. The light rays then invoke all their quick wisdom and realizations in the form of countless syllable D and Om Ahum syllables. Countless Ds and Om Ahums fill all of space. All of these seed syllables, all of these omahums, absorb into you, uniting with you like snow falling into the ocean. Your entire body and nervous system becomes the nature of quick wisdom that destroys all physical diseases and mental hindrances to developing all types of wisdom, particularly quick wisdom. Feel that you have generated quick wisdom through concentrating on the seed syllables and Om Ahum. And we request, please inspire me to generate profound wisdom, which understands the meaning of the scriptures in a profound, limitless way. Powerful light, like billions of suns, radiates from the D and mantra syllables at Manjushri's heart, going out through all the pores of your body and touching all universal sentient beings who are immediately released from their ignorance and become Manjushri. The light rays then invoke all their profound wisdom and realizations in the form of Manjushri's sword and text, countless swords and texts filling all of space. All the billions of swords and texts absorb into you, through the pores of your body, uniting with you like snow falling into the ocean. Your entire body and nervous system become the nature of profound wisdom, destroying all physical diseases and hindrances to developing all types of wisdom. Feel that you've generated profound wisdom through concentrating on the swords and texts. We request, please inspire me to generate the wisdom of explaining or teaching the Dharma, which can perfectly explain the definite, correct understandings of all the words and meanings of the scriptures. In response, much powerful light, like billions of suns, radiates from the D and mantra syllables at Manjushri's heart, 
going out through all the pores of your body, touching all the universal sentient beings who are immediately released from their ignorance and become Manjushri. The light rays then invoke all their explaining wisdom and realizations in the form of countless perfection of wisdom texts, filling all of space, radiating light. All the billions of Perfection of Wisdom texts absorb into you through the pores of your body, uniting with you like snow falling into the ocean. Your entire body and nervous system becomes the nature of explaining wisdom. The light of the wisdom destroys all physical diseases and hindrances to developing all types of wisdom. Feel that you have generated explaining wisdom through concentrating on the Perfection of Wisdom Sutra. And we request, please inspire me to generate the wisdom of debate, which courageously refutes the damaging words that express wrong ideas and misconceptions. And from the D in mantra syllables of Manjushri's heart, Powerful light like billions of suns radiate, going out through all the pores of your body, touching all universal sentient beings who are immediately released from their ignorance and become Manjushri. The light rays then invoke all their wisdom of debate and realizations in the form of countless wheels of swords. These wheels of swords fill all of space all sizes, all radiating light. And all these billions of wheels of swords absorb into you through the pores of your body, uniting with you like snow falling into the ocean. Your entire body, nervous system, becomes the nature of debate wisdom which destroys all physical diseases and hindrances to developing all types of wisdom. Feel that you've generated debating wisdom through concentrating on the wheels of swords. And we request, please inspire me to generate the wisdom of composition, which uses perfect grammar and words and has meanings of clear wisdom that gives joy to the minds of all sentient beings. And in response, much powerful light, like billions of suns, radiates from the Dee and Mantra Garland at Manjushri's heart, going out through all the pores of your body, touching all universal sentient beings. They are immediately released from their ignorance and become Manjushri. The light rays then invoke all their wisdom of composition and realizations in the form of countless wheels of swords and texts containing the perfection of wisdom. Wheels of swords and perfection of wisdom texts filling all of space, all in the nature of light. and all the billions of wheels of swords and perfection of wisdom texts absorb into you through the pores of your body, uniting with you like snow falling into the ocean. Your entire body and nervous system becomes in the nature of the wisdom of composition. Wisdom light destroys all physical diseases and hindrances to developing all the types of wisdom. Feel that you've generated the wisdom of composition in particular through concentrating on these wheels of swords and perfection of wisdom texts.
Imagine that Manjushri's wisdom body appears as a D lying on your tongue with its head towards the back of your mouth. From the D, light rays emanate in all directions and transform into offerings, protection umbrellas, victory banners, etc. They're all offered to the Buddhas and Bodhisattvas. Their blissful, omniscient wisdom and realizations manifest as orange Ds that absorb into the D on your tongue. We then recite the seed syllable of Manjushri, the syllable D. As we say, each D, a duplicate D, emanates from the D on your tongue, dissolves into the D at your heart. Marabazana did it, 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 Immeasurable orange light rays radiate from the D, filling your entire body, purifying all negative karma, sickness, and hindrances. Think, I have received the special qualities of memory, which does not forget the words and meanings of the teachings, and of knowledge of all things past, present, and future. And then we recite Vajrasattva's mantra to purify any excesses, Omissions, mistakes. Om Vajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dena Padishta Dita Mibawa Sudokaya Mibawa Supokaya Mibawa Anorakta Mibawa Sawa Siddhi Me Prayatsa Sawa Kama Sutsa Me Siddham Sriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mame Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sattva Ahum Pe Om Vajrasava Samaya Manapalaya Vajrasava Dena Bhadishtadari Rami Bhava Surukaya Mi Bhava Supukaya Mi Bhava Hanarakta Mi Bhava Sava Siddhi Mi Bharata Sava Kama Sutsume Siddham Shriyam Guru Hum Ha Ho Bhagavan Sava Tata Gata Vajra Mami Mutsa Vajra Bhava Maha Samaya Sava Aung Pe Om Vajrasava Samaya Manapalaya Vajrasava Dena Bhadishtadari Rami Bhava Surukaya Mi Bhava Supukaya Mi Bhava Hanarakta Mi Bhava Sava Siddhi Mi Bharata Sava Kama Sutsume Siddham Shriyam Guru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagavan Sava Tata Gata Vajra Mami Mutsa Vajra Bhava Maha Samaya Sava Aung Pay. Manjushri then dissolves and absorbs into me. Manjushri's mind and my mind become non-dual. My body becomes clean and clear like crystal and very blissful. My mind is like Manjushri's, saturated by compassion and wisdom. Concentrate on this. Manjushri reappears at my crown to help me engage in extensive deeds for the benefit of all sentient beings. By the virtue of this practice, may I quickly accomplish the powerful attainments of Manjushri, and then may I lead all beings to that same supreme state. May the precious Bodhi mind, not yet born, arise and grow. May that born have no decline, but increase forevermore.